You can't park here. Why not? Is this not a reasonable place to park? Reasonable? You're parked on the lawn! <laughs> Sorry! I can't be late for my big moment. Well, well folks, we've, we've had, had plenty of worthy, worthy winners, winners, but now, now it's, it's time, time for the number one prize. The, the big fish, fish the, the crown jewel, jewel the, the golden boot! Ah, I'm just in time for my award. Nice of you to join us, El Matador. Yeah, only two hours late. Award ceremonies are so boring. Yep, keep telling yourself that, Shakes. It'll make it easier for you when I win the golden boot. And the, and the nominees, nominees are... Oh, here's my moment. Rihanna from, from Barca, Barca FC. FC. El, El Matador from, from Super Strikers. Strikers. <laughs> Scar from, from Invincible United. United. And Shakes from Super Strikers. And the winner But I'm not gonna make it this easy for you next year. <laughs> Wouldn't expect any less, dude. Once again, your team carries you to the trophy. Well, maybe you should try to pass to your team once in a while. It really helps win those trophies. Please, look at him. If it was just you versus me, I'd win every time. Pity there isn't a the biggest cheat award, because then you would win every time. Wow, guys. Oh, guys. First, First Super Strikers won the league last, last season, and now this? I couldn't have done it without my team. You hear that? I, he couldn't have done it without me. Well, well anyway, anyway thanks, thanks, everyone. everyone. Looking forward to an even bigger challenge next season. <laughs> Why wait till next season, Shakes? Mr. Shakes, what's this? Dear Shakes, Miss Altibu invites you to her private island for a soccer challenge like no other. Ah, oh, come on! You get the golden boot and the fancy golden letter? No fair. Mr. Matador. Now that's more like it. Dear El Matador, your car has been towed. Huh? Ah! You really thinking of going to that island, Shakes, ma? Well... It would be nice to do something different. But you're going to miss out on the end-of-season barbecue at Dancing Rasta's house. Relaxing in the sun. Listening to groovy tunes. And chowing down as much delicious grub as we can fit in our bellies. It is important to take a break, Ma. Don't worry. I'll be fine. What's that, Skara? Hey, back. Shortly. Welcome to El Tibo's Island. Whoa. Hi, Shakes. Ah! El Matador, what are you doing here? Eh, my invite must have got lost in the post. <laughs> Very funny, Shakes. <laughs> Shakes? Hey, guys. Hey, Shakes. Hey, what's, hey, what's hey, happening, man. dude? Well, well, well. It's Mr. Golden Boot himself. I see you're about your babysitter, Shakes. <laughs> ha! The only thing I sit on is chairs. And sometimes the ground when there are no chairs available. So, what's this all about? I don't know. Haven't seen anyone since we got here. Huh. Probably trying to sell us timeshare. Gentlemen. <laughs> I'm offering something much more exciting than that. The challenge of a lifetime. An idyllic tropical island converted into the ultimate testing ground for the ultimate footballers. Dribbling, balance, stamina. This is your chance to test your skills against your greatest opponents. Then, 
The last two standing will face off in the ultimate soccer showdown. And why should we play in your little tournament? Yeah, what's in it for us? A chance to find out which of you is truly the greatest player of your generation. But... If any of you aren't feeling up to the challenge, my planes are available to take you home. Yeah. Why don't you losers go home and have a skinny frappa dappuccino? I'll stay here and win. Not a chance, Skara. Oh, you gotta stay, Shakes. I'm gonna show everyone why I should have won the golden boot. All right, let's do this. I'm so sorry, Almatador. My tournament is for award winners only. Cruel fate. Why do you hate me? Why don't you just go and relax in the VIP lounge? Hmm. <sighs> There's a complimentary gift bag. Gift bag, eh? It will be mine! For the rest of you, destiny awaits. Good luck! I'll see you at the finish line. <laughs> if you survive that long. <laughs> Ready for some good old holiday fun, eh, Shakes? Yeah, just wish I brought my swimming trunks. Ah, it's good to take a break from football, man. So, here's the game plan. No chop. Watch the rear. Rump is sizzling, Captain. Cool Joe. Keep working them wings. Got you, brother. Twisting tiger. Make some space in the center. Ah! Already on it. El Matador, you... El Matador? Where's El Matador? Probably running late. Again. Uh, guys, you got to see this. This is the biggest TV I have ever seen in my whole life. It's a beautiful day, Klausmann. Why don't you come outside? But the television has 3D. Um, outside is 3D. Yeah, but does outside have a built-in built karaoke, karaoke function? function? La, la. Run for your lives, brothers. <laughs> la. Do not trip or slip or fumble when you rumble in the jungle. Oh, out the way, puny man child. Super Strikers may have finished top of the log, but you know nothing of jungle combat. This pathetic island is like under 13 training at Iron Tanker! Whoa. Intense, bros. Yeah, looks dangerous. <laughs> Race you. Challenges are nothing compared to finding the VIP lounge. More like very impossible to find lounge. <laughs> Scar, you jerk! Why did you take out Laquito? Yeah. yeah, most dishonorable. You losers can hold hands and sing Kumbaya, but I'm here to win. Uh, guys, we've got a problem. A big problem.
Keep the ball up on the pillar thriller, and try not to fall. The drop's quite a killer. Huh? Did you guys hear that? Hear what, exactly? That's a long way down. Ready to join the team? Just pass it! Chuck, don't! <laughs> Scar! Yeah, yeah, we've been over this, I'm a bad, bad boy. Now, which one of you losers should I take out next? Bingo! <laughs> Scara, sad to see you eliminated. Our audience was loving your rivalry with Shakes. Audience? What audience? <laughs> you were on my brand new reality show. Standing by. Soccer Island. Pillar Thriller. Scara fails, Shakes prevails. There are four superstars left. But only two will make it to the Volcano Showdown, and only one will be crowned the King of Soccer Island. This whole thing is fake? I prefer the term scripted reality. Now, why don't you catch the rest of the show in the VIP lounge? And watch Shakes win? Yeah, right. I've had enough of Loser Island. Dudes, that looks so good. Oh, yum. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> Not so fast. Just a few more minutes, man. I want this meat cooked to perfection. Guys, you gotta come see this. Hey, Klaus, how many times we gotta tell you we're not gonna listen to you sing karaoke? No, you guys really gotta come see this. <sighs> Shakes is on TV. His big secret elite tournament is... A celebrity reality show? Uh, reality TV is so lame. It's all fake, you know? Totally scripted. Come on, guys. <laughs> the barbecue waits for no one. Yeah! 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 Who is in hot enough form to make it to the volcano in Flamo? An epic final showdown above scorching lava. Could watch for a few minutes. <laughs> Is this the VIP lounge? Pouches seem comfy. Not sure about the weird decor, though. But no gift bag. Huh? Please, oh please. Uh, I'll never find the VIP lounge. Why are you even bothering? They won't let you in. You didn't win an award. Uh, yeah, except for the Super League trophy. Heard of that one? Whatever. Huh? What do we have here? Time to give you losers a dose of real reality. this party. Altivo, we found the source of the interference. Auxiliary control room three. Scara. I'll call security. No, I have a better idea. 
If there's one thing the audience loves more than a hero, it's a bad, bad villain. Volcano Soccer, here we come. You know I'm not going easy on you, my friend. Wouldn't expect any less, dude. Shakes and Riano head for the final challenge, but they don't know that an evil force is at work. What? Scara? Dude, told you it's all fake. Why would Scara be in the control room? If I can't win, no one will. Some holiday this turned out to be, eh, Shake? Don't worry. I got you, dude. I don't think so, my friend. Looks like I let you off easy again. I guess this means Shakes has won it. All right, I'll admit it. This is kind of cool. For reality TV. Kind of cool? That's the most insane thing I've ever seen! Wow, it's like I can actually smell the smoke from the volcano. Oh, no, man! The barbecue! <laughs> okay, are we done here, Altivo? Riano's out. I'm the only one left. Huh? The game's changed, Shakes. Ah! No! Come on! How did you get back into the tournament? Oh, wait. Let me guess. You cheated. Boo-hoo! Pity there's no ref for you to winch to, no teammates to carry you, and no Super League rules to hide behind. Now we'll see who's really the best. He's a natural. Audience is waiting. Let's get the ball rolling. Shall we? <laughs> you lose, Shakes. No matter how many trophies you win, you'll always know that one on one, I'm the king. Huh? Rocket! Uh, oh, brother. I can't look. Uh, 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 now the whole world's gonna see who deserves the golden boot. What are you talking about? Cheer, slow. None of this is real. You're on reality TV shakes. But not for much longer. <gasps> huh? Uh -huh. <gasps> what? Uh, shakes! If we're on TV, your ratings are about to take a dive. Uh, no! Still no VIP room? I just can't win. El Matador wins! How did he get up there? I don't know, Miss Altivo. He's supposed to be in the VIP room. They fought through the jungle, balanced above the abyss, held their nerve in the murky depths, and battled it out above a fiery volcano. But only one player had the skill, bravery, and stamina to become the first ever champion of Soccer Island. <laughs> I always knew I had it in me. <laughs> What is Soccer Island? All that planning, all that hard work. You can't control everything, Miss Altivo. It is reality TV. You're fired! You idiot! You let him win? He's not even supposed to be here! Why don't you complain to the ref? All right, there isn't one. Shakespeare! Shakespeare. Shakespeare. 
I'm glad you're all right, man. Me too, my friend. So what do you think of Soccer Island? Well, it's not every day I get to play on top of a volcano. Duh. You people make me want to puke. I'm going to the VIP lounge. This is a great honor. Now where's my gift bag? I won. But he didn't even have a golden ticket. What did I say? Fake. Maybe it's meant to be a twist ending? Yeah, the twist is we just wasted our afternoon. At least we still have the delicious food. Huh? No! 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 Reality TV sucks! Told you! Totally sucks, dudes! We're in the final few minutes at Strikerland, and the score is still tied! But Liquido makes another break for goal. And he's fast as ever, 18 miles an hour. But if there's one man who can keep up with him, it's Twisting Tiger. 19 miles an hour. 20 miles an hour for Liquido. Oh, 21 for Tiger. From Laquido. But the ref says play on. Looks like you need a new lucky charm, bro. With Twisting Tiger on the ground, no one can catch Laquido. Goal! Oh. It's one nil to the visitors. And there's Laquido's signature shirt up celebration. Can you believe that guy? Yeah, Laquido totally fouled you, Tiger. Just wait till next game. You're gonna own him. Oh, please. If you think you're gonna get lucky at the floating stadium, you're wrong. I'm always faster at home. Voila! Hmm. Too much fat, too much sauce, and too much food. I need the guys lean and mean for the return leg. I am Jacques Cousteau, creator of culinary intrigue. I am not here to help people diet. Sorry, Jacques. Extreme circumstances call for extreme preparation. Isn't that right, boys? Whoa, <laughs> Whoa this is awesome, coach. Uh, what are we doing in here? Rough? No, oh, nah. Well, it's quite possible Hydro are the fastest team in the Super League because of their ingress to the greatest natural resistance training apparatus in the known universe. Um, uh, can you translate that for the average human? <laughs> and also for El Matador, please. Hydro train underwater. He's a gargabazigal! Exactly, Block. Water is a thousand times denser than air. Training in it will make playing on land seem like, well, actually running on air. Okay, let's see if underwater training has made you any faster on land. Fastest first. Yeah, look out, Liquido. Tiger, you hit 24 miles per hour last game. Let's see if you can beat that. Gotcha, coach. 20. It sticks! Unbelievable. Dude. Oh, man. And. The longer you train in water, the faster you'll be. We leave for the floating stadium in three days. Uh, back in the tank? Back in the tank. Seven years at ship school. Nine years at Bistro Bazanto. Six Michelin stars for this. What is this? It's what I call rice limage. Rice on a bit of more rice in the shape of your face. <laughs> Come on, coach. We've trained underwater the whole week. Can't we have some real food? Your training will count for nothing if you aren't lean and mean, boys. Yeah, coach. We're lean and you're mean. 
How about a deal? If we beat Hydra, we get to have an awesome feast right here on the way home. So, what do you say, coach? <sighs> sure. Yeah! <laughs> 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 You ready to lose again? Don't be so sure, dude. Yeah, been doing some underwater training of our own. What? Did you practice in the bathtub? We train in the ocean, right up until the game. That's why we're always faster at home. Tiger hit 28 miles an hour. Yeah, that's right. He'd beat you for pace anytime, any place. Oh yeah? How about right now? on the bottom of the ocean. What? I don't know about this, guys. Next level underwater training? A chance to show Liquido up? Come, Come on, on, dude! dude. <sighs> Fine. Compact breathing apparatus? Air lasts for ages. Comms device, built into your mask. Good for dissing. <gasps> Weight belt, stops you from floating back up to the surface. Helpful. have a choice. Been thrown in the deep end. You see anything? Too far down. Man, worst FOMO ever. Ready to be school. <laughs> faster. What are you think of that, Liquido? Huh? Liquido? <laughs> huh? See a match day, bro. No! Wait, Liquido! How do I get this belt off? With my lucky charm. Mwah! <laughs> Tiger? <gasps> yeah, you weigh a ton, dude. How do you get this thing off? You can't. Liquido set me up. There's only one key, and he has it. Oh, uh, that sea snake. Yeah, what was I thinking? We gotta tell Coach. No, 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 no. Don't need to bother him, dude. We'll totally find the key. Hmm, I don't know. Come on, we got this. <sighs> Fine. <laughs> You've heard of the Super League, right? Now, low in fat, low in amoeba acids, and low in taste as well, I give you Super Legumes. Uh, beans? Yeah, beans. All worth it when we beat Hydra, boys. Any luck? <sighs> No sign of the key. Or Liquido. Tiger? Uh, Jock! So, how's the celebration menu coming along? It will be 
One of the finest meals I have ever made. And definitely the finest meal any of you have eaten. Really? Like, what are you thinking? Oh, how about hot dogs, Jacques? <laughs> of course! Yeah, yeah, you bet that sounds good dog. to me. I would rather make the diet food. Stupid faulty chair. Uh, what a weak chair, right? I know what's going on here. Tiger. You haven't been sticking to the diet, have you? Uh, busted, Tiger. <laughs> Get back on track, Tiger. We need you in top form tomorrow. <sighs> Too close. You guys said you'd get me out of this thing. Now do it. Telling coach. <sighs> aye, aye, aye. Oh, God, uh, oh no! This is bad. Uh, you must really feel like you have the weight of the world on your shoulders. It isn't the weight of the world. It's Hydra's weight. Weren't you listening? Oh, sorry, guys. I've let everyone down. I was ready for this game, and now I'm useless. <sighs> Coach, we'll do whatever it takes to sort this out. Correct. You two are getting the toughest job on the pitch. Twisting Tiger's job. You're marking Liquido. Tiger, just because you're on the bench doesn't mean we don't need you 100% focused on this game. Sure, Coach. First health food, now. <clears throat> At dogs. I feel so ashamed. Hey, Mr. Chef, you open for business? <laughs> I am Jacques Cousteau. I serve kings, not peasants. Aw, oh, come on, dude. Game's about to start, and I gotta get my munch on. Yeah, we'll eat whatever. Prepare yourselves for the gourmet feast of a lifetime. Match day at the Floating Stadium. Oh boy, here we go, Brenda. Tiger versus Laquido, the battle of the speedsters. Uh, I don't think so, Mac. Uh, what is Coach thinking? He's put his fastest player on the bench. But, but, why? And we're off. Ten super strikers contain Liquido without twisting Tiger. Shakes immediately marks Liquido. But you don't need a speed tracker to know he's just not fast enough. Too soon, Brenda. Too soon. Now <laughs> North is on Liquido. Coach isn't ah. giving Hydra an inch. Liquido's through on goal! But great last-ditch tackle from North Shaw. <laughs> this is a good start from Super Strikers. Shakes and North are making life tough for Liquido. I don't know if I can keep this up for 90 minutes. Maybe we don't have to. Follow my lead. Prepare to have your taste buds enlightened. Uh, you don't do hot dogs? You said you did anything I served. 
Yeah, but it's a soccer match, bud. You gotta make hot dogs. The hot dogs are for super strikers. If I give them to you, what would they eat? <laughs> Two hot dogs coming right up. We are well into the final third, and still no sign of Twisting Tiger. <laughs> Wow, Laquito, you are fast. Huh. Don't you know it? Pity you don't have a chance to prove you're the fastest. Huh? Well, Tiger did beat you on your underwater pitch. Uh, hello? I threw the underwater game? Sure you did, buddy. In a real race, I take Twisting Tiger any day. Oh, yeah? Prove it. <laughs> right. You want me to give you the key. Nice try. But this game ain't for pride. It's for points. Go! Finally, Super Striker's two on one strategy has caved in. And here comes Liquido's shirt up celebration. Uh, or not. <gasps> How do I get this belt off? With my lucky charm. Coach, Liquido's signature celebration. He didn't do it. So? Really? Put me on and I'll find out. Can you even get close to Liquido with that belt on? One chance is all I need. <laughs> Hundreds of hot dogs, ready to roll! Delicious! Two for me, please! <laughs> Thanks, man! Gotta scram! Something big's happening! Good riddance to bad nourishment. Tell your friends, okay? Super Striker's substitution. Ah, finally! worked. <laughs> Guess we have final proof your charm isn't lucky, bro. You should worry about your own lucky charm. <gasps> what? Underwater training makes you fast? It's nothing compared to weight belt training. Liquido shoots! Big Bo is beat! What? Looks like the tide may have turned. <laughs> Come on, dude. I thought you'd take Twisting Tiger any day. <sighs> 29 miles an hour for Tiger! But Liquido is still on him, Matt. <laughs> Hey, Liquido. See, my lucky charm always delivers. Hey, uh, do you think if I kissed that thing, I'd get more lucky? <coughs> well done, Tiger. That was some plan. 
Now, unless I'm mistaken, it's time to chow down on some epic hot dogs! Woohoo! Take it in now! Get your hot dogs here! The finest hot dogs ever created! Hey! Isn't that our celebration meal? Now that's fast food. Jacques, what is going on here? I'm just giving the people what they want. And they wanted hot dogs! But what are we gonna eat? Finally, a five-star gourmet fist pit for Super League Kings. Bon appétit, Super Strikers. Uh, what is that? Uh. <laughs> Being the most refined of all of you, I love this gourmet food. Snails and fish eggs. Whoa! Coach, where are Tiger Shakes and Noah? Do you really think I'd let them join the feast after the stunt they pulled? Oh, shame. Poor guys. All right, Tiger! <laughs> uh, but how? They ran out so fast. Not as fast as me. <laughs> Great accuracy, boys. Yeah. Looking good, Captain. Unfortunately, mm -hmm. good isn't good enough. Oh, come on, Coach. Coach, we're totally awesome! No? Take a look at this. Colonel Von Pushup, you just crushed Hydra in their home waters. How'd you do it? Johan Uber's marshalling in the midfield was visionary. Thor's shooting was unstoppable. And no one can get past our newest weapon, the Mangler. <laughs> Are you confident you can execute the same against Super Strikers next week? The Fortress Stadium may be up in the mountains, but Super Strikers are going down. <sighs> this is Lena Long, Football 360, signing out. <laughs> Feeling warm and looking good. This is why I never pack light. Coach, uh, can we have our secret training mission somewhere warmer? I want you all ready for the extreme cold before we play at the Fortress Stadium. That's not gonna help us if we can't get past the Mangler. Dude, super scary. It's like he reacts before you even kick the ball. That's why we have this. A ball? This new plan of yours is pure genius, Coach. This isn't any ball. Whoa. It's GPS chipped for tracking speed, air pressure, and direction. If you can kick the ball harder than 100 miles an hour, you can beat the Mangler. Man, that's fast. Never stop believing. It is possible, Shakespeare. Right, guys? <laughs> Dot the spirit block. R. Drago? Super Strikers, this is your pilot speaking. Please fasten your seatbelts. We're in for an interesting landing. Attention, Iron Tank! This is your coach speaking! Ah, we can hear you! We are right here, Colonel! Colonel, I have picked up a nearby GPS signal! All the way out here? Hmm... Directive, change course! Ah, directive understood. Ah! Smooth landing, eh, hey boys? Man, too smooth. 
<laughs> Big Bo, your mangler for the afternoon. Sure thing. How's this? <laughs> hmm. Not bad. The rest of you, let's get to it. Make it fast, Shakes. Sure thing, Coach. Ah! Bring it. Strikers, what are they doing here? Directive Lippery! Of all the icebergs they could run into, it had to be ours? Blagger blog. blog. Smooth, 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 smooth. Talking in code. Very clever. Colonel, the chipped object is moving. Directive, find the source of the signal. Already have. Let Whoa. me see. A GPS ball? I think I know what Super Strikers are up to. A Bond push-up. If I'd known you were visiting, I would have tidied up. Well, considering we are here, how about a little friendly? You're on. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Colonel, the ball reached 72 miles an hour. Ha! Takes more than that to beat the mangler. Shakes, man! Hands up! Yes! Colonel! Dancing Rasta beats the mangler! What? Directive! Get the ball! Directive understood. That was amazing, Captain. How did you do it? You won't believe what happened. I... Huh? Where's he off to? <gasps> the ball! Captain, wait! Iceberg now. We're all taking a long, cold swim. Come on, Captain. Uh, 
Feeling so cold yet? I'm just getting warmed up, man. <laughs> Time to blow the lid on your mission. Sorry, guys, I know just how to wake him up. <gasps> oh, dude. Nope, he's out cold. Ah! Ah! Dude, you killed him! <sighs> Sorry, cold messes with our equipment all the time. Is he gonna be okay, Doc? Your captain's had a serious shock to the system. His body isn't used to such extreme cold. Unfortunately, I can't say what will wake him up. He could be asleep for a few hours, or... Or... or what? Or... a very long time. Captain, when you awaken, you will be in this foreign place without the necessities of life. So I leave you this gift. The world's most powerful hairdryer. Technical difficulties? Yeah, water damage. Don't worry. Keeping our equipment running in this court has taught me that sometimes all you need is a little bit of improvisation. <laughs> Target reacquired. Directive. Libre! <laughs> The hair dryer trick works every time. How long will it take to dry out? Hmm, difficult to say, but I'll call you as soon as I can access the data. Directive! <gasps> Stay out! Match day at the Fortress Stadium, Brenda, and the teams are warm enough. But without dancing Rasta, will Super Strikers be left out in the cold, Mac? Uh, is that what I think it is? Uh-huh. Sure, you didn't see how Rasta did that power kick? You were right there, brother. Heads up! The mist was too thick. I couldn't see. Huh. Frozen ball, a frozen captain, and a frozen brain. Great. Come on. There's nothing we can do about the ball right now, Shakes. Concentrate on the game. <laughs> that 
it's half time. And super strikers are no nearer to beating the mangler. Dancing Rasta! Dancing Rasta! Dancing! I guess they really do need Dancing Rasta, mm -hmm. Mac, but he's he's nowhere to be seen. Yes! <laughs> Directive, move on target. Directive understood. Hi, Shapes. Hello, Doc. Great news. All the data is still intact. Are you with the ball now? No. Why? Approaching target. I would take her after the ball. Don't worry. I'm right next door to you. Hey. Let me out. <laughs> Don't even think about it. No! Directive! Get that ball! Give it up, man! As my doctor, I prescribe lots of rest. Captain, huh? you're okay. Oh, everyone's gonna be so relieved. And you can tell us how you beat the mangler. Sure. One thing, though. Shoot, Captain. Who are you again? You knew that ball was our best shot, so you tried to steal it again. Yeah, well, it seemed easier than stealing Rasta. <laughs> well, you should have stolen Rasta. Huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah! <laughs> Welcome yeah. back, Rasta. Welcome back, dude! Great to meet you. Uh -huh. Oh, right. Shakes told me. We're teammates. This is a cruel disease. How can anyone forget me? Oh. I want to help you guys, but how can I be the captain of the Super Strikers? Hmm. Huh? <laughs> well, if anything's gonna remind you who you are, it's this. Thanks, Shakes. Shakes mom, eh? The real Rasta calls me Shakes mom. Well, he's not here right now, okay? The return of their captain, even from the sidelines, could be just the charm Super Strikers need. Well, he'd better work his magic soon, because Super Strikers are running out of time. Whoa. As the play intensifies, Johan Uber takes things a bit too far. You and your captain are as ineffective as each other. Shakes mine! It was, it was just Shakes mine! What's he 
What's he saying? That's easy. It was downward pressure. Shakespeare. Mm -hmm. With their captain on ice, Super Strikers are looking directionless. So, what's the plan? Stand on the ball. Uh, brilliant! Uh, no, wait. The exact opposite of that. Downward pressure? Push down on the ball, and it'll shoot out like a rocket. Where do you get this crazy idea from? Dancing Rasta. Um, which Dancing Rasta? He's back, El Matador. He called me Shakesmon. Uh, guess we got nothing to lose. Except the game, right? Come on, Shakes and El Matador. Time's a ticking. Final chance of the game. <laughs> Team effort, as usual. Now come on, guys, let's go home. I've had enough of this cold. Hey, check it out. Directive, scrub! I really, really hate the loudspeaker. I guess Iron Tank's performance was really substandard. <laughs> come on. Uh, yeah, uh, come on. Uh. He's through the Nakama midfield, last chance before full time. Shakes, aren't you bored of that game yet? Yeah, you clock it like every time you play. I don't know why you play that thing at all, brother. Why would you want to play fake football when you're going to jam the real thing against Nakama tomorrow? <laughs> Super League 3000X is just like real soccer, Cool Joe. Sorry, Shakes. Games just don't impress me. The ball gets away from him. Missed opportunity. <laughs> It is kind of dated, but apparently the new version is going to be so good. Amazing graphics and super realistic sound effects. <gasps> oh, yeah. Ooh. And the world's best players. Coming soon. Super League 4000X. Woohoo! Yeah! Oh, big XP feeling totally nerfed right now. <laughs> I'm Alex. I'm gonna motion capture your moves for SL4000X. Hi, Alex. I'm Shakes. Uber, cool. You wanna... Um, it's Shakes, not Uber. Uh, Uber's from Iron Tank. Uh, it's an expression. Ah, saws. Uh, uh, I mean, sorry. Sometimes I forget how people speak out there. You ready for the grand tour? Huh? <laughs> Yo, 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 it's Uncle Joe. Phew, is that a funny smell or is it just a ping pong? Table tennis to you, sucker. Uh, so I'm guessing you know each other? Hey guys, meet Chill John, world's number one ping pong player. Table tennis? Everything he knows about, well, everything really, he borrowed from yours truly. Police! I'm past those beginner techniques, sucker. I am the new king of spin. Your style is still cool, Joe. Your spin is thin. Huh. <coughs> We're starting. You guys coming? First up, it's the coders. Super intelligent brainiacs who build the games. Test 
protesters basically play games and eat chocolate the whole day. <laughs> cool. Where do I sign up? Here we have the sound studio. Real Super League players and coaches are contributing their voices to SL4000X. Yeah, good call. The sound effects in 3000 kind of sucked. Game over. You lose. <laughs> Game over. You lose. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, okay, we're, we're getting there. Can you make it feel more summery, more sunny? What? This isn't the weather report. Don't worry. We're almost there. Take 346. Go. Uh, I give up. And finally, where the real magic happens. Super Strikers. The Motion Capture Studio is where we capture every detail of your moves. Every detail, hey? <laughs> yes, yes, genius, fantastic. Do it again, but into the microphone this time, yeah? Oh. Welcome to the Motion Capture Studio. The position and movement of the sensors on your suits are recorded by special cameras, and the data is input into this computer. All right, Whoa. Irene. <laughs> oh, please, Alex. Don't be motion capturing this, okay? <laughs> Don't worry. The only thing I want to capture is all the classic Super Strikers moves. times I gotta tell you guys, video games just ain't my thing. But the game won't be the same without the four pillars of spin. I don't know, brother. <sighs> Come on. All right, all right, I'll do it. <laughs> hey, what do you think you're doing? I, uh, um... It's not Cosplay Friday, is it? No. Oh, I feel like such a fool. Don't. You're rocking that look. Great costume. Uh, thanks. Hey, why don't we swap? Really? Really. Like, really, really? Really, really. Like, really! Get ready for the four pillars of spin. Left spin. Right spin. Back spin. How does he spin the ball like that? Unbelievable. Can't wait to see this stuff in gameplay. <laughs> Top spin. I got this one. I got this one. Uh, OK, you can have this one. <laughs> Thanks, sister. And how do you guys know where the ball's gonna go? Practice makes perfect. Uh, more like practice and practice and practice makes perfect. SL4000X is gonna rock! You guys have been so much help! Yes. You've been so much help, Super Strikers. And there you have it, Cool Joe's four pillars of spin. Know them, spot them, intercept them. It will always be one of four. This is going to make Super Striker's head spin. <laughs> huh? Now I get the laugh right. It's Nakama versus Super Strikers live 
from Gashuko Stadium. These two famous rivals are equally matched. But if one player can make the difference, it's Cool Joe. The Crossing King. There's the cross. Shakes and El Matador are there. Can one of them get a touch? What? Ooh, well read by Miko Chen. <laughs> Looks like Cool Joe just needs to kick to me next time. Yes? Hmm. Super Strikers try to regroup. But it's no use. Oh! Nakama take the first game. Seems the Crossing King has been dethroned. You lose, Super Strikers. <laughs> game over. You lose. <laughs> uh... Cool Joe? What? I think I know why Nakama can read your four spins. Oh, really? How? Urigiri was at the mocap studio yesterday. <laughs> Rewind there, brother. Urigiri was where? I'm sorry. I think he saw your moves. What did I tell you? All that digital juju, no emotion capture, wireless bleh, is no good, brother. Hey! Cool Joe, you need to think about what happens to my ego when I'm not scoring goals, man. And don't be so selfish, okay? Thanks for coming by. We're totally gonna get our revenge in the return match. How, Shakes? Urigiri saw all my moves. The four pillars of spin ain't secret anymore. Hey, look on the bright side, Cool Joe. It can't get any worse. <clears throat> yo, 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 yo. Don't worry. I already signed this one for ya. Paddle power? I saw Nakama shut you down, Cool Joe. Told you I'm the new king of spin. But don't worry. Maybe you can learn a thing or two from my game. I got speed you can't even imagine. Ah! You like game shakes? Why not play ping pong till the new Super League game comes out? Table tennis, fool! Spin you can't even imagine, huh? Level one. Your spin is thin. Level 10, sucker. Not bad. Level 24, are you the next speed master? Level 36, you got some moves. I knew I could do it. Oh. I gotta find Jill John. Oh, come on, Shakes. At least wash your hands. Thanks for the help, Alex. It's the least I can do after my noob mistake with a mocap. This is the place. But I don't know how we're gonna get in, especially considering you're friends with Cool Joe. Undercover, of course. Don't want to give the game away. Uh, didn't we already do that?
fifth spin. That's how Cool Joe can beat Nakama. So, who's next? Who wants to play the king of spin? Shakes, what are you doing here? I'm here about the corkscrew. Seriously, Cool Joe, there is a fifth spin, and I know how you can learn it. Please, Shakes, I've already learned my lesson. Why would I take your advice ever again? Listen to him, Cool Joe. Yeah, come on, we need you out there. Or I might not score any goals. Whatever. All Shakes has done the last few days is play Paddle Power. Yeah, that's kind of how I found out about the fifth spin. Video games, table tennis, Chill John. These are a few of my least favorite things. The fifth spin exists. I developed it. Hm. I'll believe it when I see it. To help you learn the corkscrew extra fast, we're gonna mocap it and analyze it. Just like Uragiri did with your moves. I guess if video games got us into this mess, video games can get us out. Uh, there's one other thing. Just like in Paddle Power, the corkscrew has to be unlocked. Really? I want to prove once and for all who's the best spinner of them all. Like I said, I don't play the palm. Uh, need goals, Cool Joe. Uh, do it for me. Uh, and the team, also. All you have to do is get one point off him. That's the at Strikerland! Last week, we saw these two teams aren't as evenly matched as they once were, Brenda. So, Coach has made a big change. Klaus is on the left wing, and Cool Joe is nowhere to be seen. Klaus is a fantastic striker. But filling the boots of the world's best left winger? Not gonna happen. None of four! <laughs> Another good laugh! <sighs> oh, man, Cool Joe's crosses make scoring easy. No, they don't. Okay, maybe they do a little. Don't worry, guys. I'm sure Cool Joe got that point by now. Yo, guy plays like a total badger. Come on, you scoundrel. Let him beat you. Just one point. No way, El Matador. I want to win fair and square. Oh, this is not the time for honor, Cool Joe. Forget your pride. Abandon your principles, man. No way. I have to embrace my principles. I'm no gamer like Shakes. I can't play table tennis like Chill John. I'm a footballer. You can do it, Mom. You can do it! John, the number one spinner mm -hmm. is always the winner. Ha <laughs> <laughs> You what are a legend. Oh, yes. Oh, what a rally. Foot table tennis? Come on! Deal's a deal, brother. The second half is underway. Fantastic news for Super Strikers. Looks like Cool Joe's on the field and immediately into the action. Woohoo! Go Cool Joe! 
Even if Kuljo can pull off the corkscrew, how do we know where it's gonna go? No practice and practice and practice, right? Yeah. And from what I've seen, the corkscrew has a mind of its own. What's the use, Kuljo? We know all your spins. All right, this is it. Fifth spin coming up. I hope. One of four. It's sailing into the danger area. But it's gone past everyone. What's that? Oh yeah, the number one spinner is always the winner. Keeping that one. Oh, oh man, SL 4000X is beyond awesome. Got you again, Urigiri. <sighs> I lose! <laughs> 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 Hey guys, yo, 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 yo. Aw, oh, Shakes, you still playing that old school SL4000X game? We're jamming our new hybrid Paddle Power versus Super League game. Spinner takes all. I just got it delivered from Alex. <laughs> Looks cool. Can I try? No way, man. I've only got to like level 41. In time, brother. In time. <laughs> as the Grim FC two of us rock and rolls into town. And part of their entourage, a terrifying new move that no goalkeeper has been able to save, the Ghost Train. Let's find out more. Coach Belmont, how did you come up with the Ghost Train? I didn't. Every coach in Grimm's long history has stored their football knowledge in an ancient, powerful book. The Tactinomicon! <gasps> Could someone please close that window? Sorry! Uh, whatever. So over the top. The ghost train does sound kind of... Don't say it, dude! Scary. Huh? Why? Really? Uh, aren't we gonna need a goalie to stop the ghost train? Yeah, why does Big Bo get time off before the game? Big Bo is doing top secret preparation for the ghost train. He's our last line of defense against them. <laughs> Strikers have a personal significance for Grim FC? Big Bo did accidentally injure your legendary striker, Spike Dawson. Not at all. Spike Dawson was a great player, but his spitefulness tainted the good name of this club. I'm glad to say we've seen the last of him. Ha! <laughs> That's what you think. My beautiful trophies. But my collection is incomplete. Not for long, though. Soon I will end Big Bo's career, just like he ended mine! And claim his gloves as my final trophy! Spike! I baked you some strudel! Mother! Don't interrupt me while I'm plotting revenge! Don't you backchat me, young man! Sorry, Mom.
planning to leave the Goalie Cave anytime soon, sir? It's getting musty in here. All worth it, Albert. I'm beginning to understand how Grimm's new move works. They stay in a very tight formation to hide the position of the ball. The keeper doesn't know where the shot is coming from. My positioning and reflexes will have to be spot on to stand any chance against the ghost train. And how do you plan to achieve that, sir? The quad cannons. Ha! I told Grim FC they'd be nothing without me! Especially after I steal their precious Tactonomicon! Now, to pay Big Bo a visit. Mom! I'm stuck! Don't worry, dearie. I'll get this brutal grits. We'll get you out of there in no time. Activate quad cannons. Quad cannons activated. Yes, yes, I heard you the first 30 times. Would you like to buy some strudel, dearie? Hmm, delicious. Come inside. I can't resist a good strudel. Why, thank you. Dearie. an authorized quad cannon technician. Ah, my beautiful trophy. <laughs> this revenge thing is getting really old, Spike. I won't stop until End I... End my career just like I ended yours. Like I said, old. But I'm not injured. Your plan failed. Ha! Ah, that's what you think. But you're not the only one who knows all the angles, Big Bo. <clears throat> huh? Huh. Uh, excuse me, sir. Could you help me, please? I'm terribly sorry, sir. That old woman lured me in with lies and delicious strudel. That wasn't an old woman. It was Spike Dawson. Spike Dawson? After all this time, what are we going to do about him? Nothing for now. I need to rest up for the game against Grimm. Are you done playing with your friend, Spike? Sworn enemy, Mother! Big Bo is my sworn enemy! And the game I'm playing is only just beginning. <laughs> Super League Disciplinary Board. I have information regarding the theft of the Tectonomicon. Morning, sir. 
sleep well? Yep. I'm ready to bring the ghost train screeching to a halt. Don't buy any strudel, okay? Very funny, sir. I'm Agent 1. I'm Agent 2. From, from the, the Super League, League Disciplinary Board. I don't have a number yet, but if I help crack the case, I can totally earn one! Read your agent rulebook, rookie. Rule 4.73. A Super League agent always remains calm. It keeps your mind clear and makes you look extra cool at all times. Uh, how exactly can I help you, gentlemen? We got a tip-off that Big Bo was involved in the theft of the Tactonomicon. You're not the only one who knows all the angles, Big Bo! Spike wasn't trying to injure me. He was trying to frame me. Mind if we take a look around? What makes you think Big Bo was involved in this crime? We got an anonymous tip. Besides, with Big Bo facing the ghost train, no one would have more to gain from stealing the book. I found it! I found it! I found it! I found it! Protocol, Junior. Rule 1.7. A Super League agent never smiles. There's some kind of grease on here. Same stuff we found on Grimm's bus. Big Bo is now our prime suspect. <laughs> I want Strike a Land secured immediately. Spike must have planted the Tactonomicon here last night. He's trying to get me banned for life. So, what are we going to do about it? Clearing my name would be good, but duty calls. The game, sir? At the risk of stating the obvious, there's nowhere to hide on a football pitch. Hmm. Maybe I don't have to. Here we go. The Super League Agent's Rulebook. I have a plan that'll let me play the game, stop the ghost train, and prove Spike framed me. Sounds easy enough, sir. Match night at Strikerland, And the terrifying Grim fans descend on the stadium. But they're nothing compared to the team itself. <laughs> But by far the weirdest thing tonight is Super Strikers are starting with their number two goalie, Noah Murdoch. If any goalie can stop the ghost train, surely it's Big Bo. Hear that, Brenda? Chugga, 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 chugga. Do, do. Here comes the ghost train. Where's the ball? No idea, dude. Super Strikers are gonna need a bigger goalie. Hold it. We're looking for someone matching your description. Never mind. Move along, kids. I'm so sorry, guys. I let you down. Don't worry, dude. No one's been able to stop the ghost train. So far. <gasps> Big Bo? Where have you been, man? Well, Spike framed me for stealing the Tactonomicon, and now I'm kind of on the run from the SLDB. Huh? I hate to be Captain Insensitive, but did you find a way to stop the ghost train, Big Bo? Don't worry, guys. I know all the angles. Wait a second. If you can stop the ghost train, it'll totally seem like you stole the Tactonomicon. It is gonna look weird, man. Have you thought about, you know, missing the save on purpose? Yeah, some things are more important than football. 
Mm. Or not. I won't let Spike Dawson win. I'm going to go out there, and I'm going to stop the ghost train. How are you even going to get on the pitch? This place is crawling with Super League agents. With a bit of luck, and a bit of help from the Super League rule book. The good news for Super Strikers fans is that the hapless Noah Murdoch has been taken off. And the uh, bad news, Mac, is that they haven't replaced him. Super Strikers are starting the second half without a goalkeeper. Big Bo, stop right there. Rule 54.72, know the suspect. You put your whole career at risk just to learn how to stop the ghost train. There's no way you'd miss this game. You, you guys got it all wrong. I didn't steal the Tactonomicon. I was framed by Spike Dawson. Give yourself up, Big Bo. You've got nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. I don't need to hide. Rule 7.94. Ah, go tell me. I know this one. <laughs> no Super League agents are allowed on the field during game time. Slip through our fingers. I want him apprehended the moment the final whistle blows. Affirmative. 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 With Big Bo back on the pitch, do Super Strikers have a chance against Grimm? We're about to find out, Brenda. Affirmative. <laughs> All right, guys. Big Bo risked everything for this team. Let's make it worth his while. Affirmative. It's a goal. This is an outrage. Big Bo's a cheat. The name Spike Dawson ring any bells? Big Bo claimed he set him up. Bah! Ridiculous. Spike Dawson's ancient history. Hello? Anybody home? What's that? You're on the run from the law? Oh, I'll just let myself in then. Oh, I've waited so long for this moment. With Big Bo out the way, I can finally collect my trophy. What? No, no! This can't be! Grim FC on the attack oh. again. But this time, the mighty Big Bo stands between them and the goal. Huh? He's playing? Those clubs will be mine! <laughs> so far, so good. It's all up to you now, sir. Big Bo helped his team level the scores! But his real challenge is about to begin! Uh, the Ghost Train! Uh, can't believe I'm saying this, but kind of hope Big Bo misses. I know what you mean, man. Affirmative. You really need some new lines, son. Affirmative. Strudo? <laughs> huh? Crunchy, delicious Strudo? Strudo? Get your hot Strudo! <gasps> gotcha. <laughs> huh? We're well into injury time. Will Big Bo prevail? Or will the ghost train? 
Ride him down. I have to lure Spike out into the open, or I'm done for. But how? Ah, my beautiful trophy. Positioning and reflexes will have to be spot on. Big Bo's taking the gloves off, literally. He's really bought into the whole showmanship thing. Big Bo will pay for his disrespect. Grim ah! broken through. Only Big Bo stands between Grim FC and victory. for Big Bull's gloves. Hey, isn't that Spike Dawson? Gotcha. What? Big Bo was telling the truth. All agents move in. Get Spike, Spike Dawson. Dawson. You did it! <laughs> oh, thanks, guys. Uh, this soccer mystery of the century and all the strudel you can eat and I missed them both. Luckily, Big Bo catches everything. Yeah, man. You really weren't kidding when you said you had all the angles covered. How did he fit in there? Strudel grease. Ew. Hey, isn't that the same stuff they found on Grimm's bus and on the Technomicon? Great work, Junior. You've earned these. <laughs> Protocol, Greenhorn. A Super League agent never smiles. But we'll allow it this one time, Agent 3. 127. Oh, what have I told you about playing in the garbage? Uh, sorry, Mother. Well, come on, then. Let's go home. Hi, guys. Welcome to another Orion fan report, live from the Soccer Sphere. We have some pretty tough games coming up. First, Invincible United, then Super Strikers. But as always, in Coach Black we trust. What? What is that? There's been an alien fighting at a soccer stadium. A close encounter of the first kind. But is it legitimate? Impossible to tell. We need a man on the ground. Anyone know anything about football? Uh, that's the one with the ball, right? I've already identified the perfect candidate. He knows soccer. He has access to the stadium. And most importantly, he's a believer. Klaus, prepare to make contact. We've just witnessed the upset of the season, boys. Orion anticipated Invincible United's every move, predicted their every strategy, and dominated the scoreline. I know how they did it. Coach Black has been getting help from aliens. This again? Uh, Klaus. I've watched this clip like 20 times. I'm telling you guys, it's real. There's no such thing as aliens. Those videos are just CGI. <laughs> Klaus has been spending way too much time on the bench, coach. If it isn't aliens, how did Orion know Invincible United's entire game plan? Coach Black obviously studied their previous games and learned their strategies. But what if he's done the same to us, Coach? Don't worry. I've developed two all-new, never-before-seen moves. <laughs> A 
it's of the utmost importance that we keep them top secret. That means no talking about them. I don't even want you to think about them. Because the aliens can read our brainwaves, right? Focus on these moves, not UFO sightings. Got it? Got it, Coach. You'd think it was match day at the soccer sphere, but actually, Orion Stadium is now the world's newest alien sightings hotspot. Take me home, E.T. They live amongst us, man. The lights! They're coming for us! I'm now joined by Orion manager Coach Black, live from his observatory on top of the soccer sphere. Coach Black, what do you make of these so-called UFO sightings? <laughs> the lights are merely a beautiful cosmic ray shower. Huh. I bet his alien overlords told him to say that. Turn that thing off already. El Matador must go betty by. Your side destroyed Invincible United last week. Some people claim you were helped by, you know, these, these... Aliens? <laughs> that is priceless. <laughs> but seriously, my secret is just, uh, for her preparation. Well, it seems like the sky is the limit for Orion. As for the UFOs, I'll leave that to the experts. The truth is totally out there, man. The lights! They're still coming for us! Why wouldn't they come to Earth? Huh? Who are you? We're a top secret organization of specialists. We search for and monitor alien activity on Earth. We're the first, second, middle, second last, and only line of defense. We are the National Extraterrestrial Reconnaissance Division. Oh, 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 oh. Ow! Oh. Ah. He always does this! The intention was for this to remain a clandestine operation, you dope! Sorry, guys. If it makes you feel any better, you put on a great show. Now, what do you guys want? We know you've been watching the lights of Orion footage. Of course. It's the most conclusive proof we are not alone. We're looking for someone who can find out the truth about the lights. Someone with access to the soccer sphere? We're looking for someone like you, Klaus. What? Me? An alien hunter? Ah, oh, I can't. What? what? Why not? We've got a big game coming up. I need to concentrate on our new... <gasps> not meant to talk about them. <gasps> not even meant to think about them. Sorry, I'm not your guy. <gasps> I knew it! Cop circles! I told you guys there were aliens here. Oh, please! There is a perfectly rational explanation for this. Yep. I made them. Huh? <gasps> no wonder you wanted me to keep quiet about the aliens. You're one of them. There's no way I was going to teach you the top secret. You know what? Then practice them at Orion's home stadium the day before the game. So I created the most private training facility in town. <gasps> this is the last time you're going to see these moves. So pay attention. No peeking, defenders. Hmm? We're going to test these moves on you guys. Move one uses the overlap to find space behind the defense. Ain't getting past us, bro. I know, but El Matador will. Move two uses pace and passing to break through the opposition defense. <laughs> nice work, boys. You get all that? I may need you out there tomorrow. Yes, coach. There's no way Orion will see these moves coming.
Klaus, haven't you watched that video enough? Beauty sleep required. Where is your rational explanation for this, El Matador? It's just, uh, Orion testing their floodlights. Floodlights coming from the sky? Well, it still makes more sense than aliens. If you're so sure about it, let's go find out. Reports are streaming in. It's happening again. That's not all. Klaus is on the move, heading right for the stadium. Ha! I knew he couldn't resist the search for the truth. Wait, we're tracking Klaus? <gasps> you guys never tell me anything. Yeah, that's because you tell your mom all our secret information. No, I don't. Hmm. Klaus seems to have activated the camera on his Digitab. I should be able to access the feed. Whoa! <laughs> mom! You gotta see this! Oh, Super League legends sneaking around like grave robbers. I can't believe I let you talk me into this. Klaus? Huh? Am I dreaming? Only if you are dreaming about how right I was. Hey, is it just me, or are these lights following a pattern? There was a pattern, yeah? Definitely a sign of intelligent life. take on the mighty Super Strikers. Here at the Soccer Sphere, it's come one, come all for alien enthusiasts. Although someone needs to tell them they're here to watch the football, not the skies. One man who will definitely be keeping his eyes on the game is Orion's coach, Black, still in his observatory. Yes, Lina. From up here, I have a perfect view of the galaxy and what's happening on the pitch. Hmm. The lights, <laughs> they're coming. <laughs> they take your brain waves. Wow, I didn't know crazy was contagious. What's gotten into you, El Matador? What, there's something inside me? Ah, oh, they laid their alien eggs inside of me. Oh, get them out, get them out. Tell me, Klaus, where do you think El Matador got all these crazy ideas? You got to listen to me. The lights, they were... Say lights one more time. I dare you. As for you, I don't care if an alien invited you to a tea party. You're in the starting lineup. Super Strikers may be in good form, but they've never played against a team receiving help from out there. Oh, Mac, not you too. <laughs> I'm just getting into the spirit of things, Brenda. Super Strikers attack and attack. But Orion are way ahead of them. Almost as if they're getting help from... Don't you say it, Mac. Move one. 
daring pass from Dancing Rasta. They obviously practiced that one in training. But Twisting Tigers run straight into a dead end. Oh, no, he hasn't. Ha -ha! Brilliant deception from Super Strikers. Wow, oh. heads up. <laughs> no way. Once again, Orion are just too good. How did Maiden know? Last chance of the first half. Come on, dude. It's up to us. Okay, let's do it, Shakes. Huh? Ah! <laughs> <gasps> They're here. Aliens! <laughs> El Matador certainly keen to get back to the locker room. Maybe he needs the toilet. That was a close one. What? Coach! You can sub me, drop me from the team, make me wash everyone's dirty socks, but you have to listen to me about the lights. Ugh, fine. You have my attention. The lights I saw last night were tracing out the exact patterns of our secret moves. Even if I did believe you, how can you prove this? I recorded it all on my Digitab last night. But I dropped it. Face it, Klaus. You don't have proof because there's no such thing as aliens. <sighs> the truth is in here. What is this? National Extraterrestrial Reconnaissance Division at your service. And we are the nerd? Really? What are you guys doing here? We've been trying to contact you, man. Uh, last night in the cornfield? That was you? You scared the pants off me. Why did you dress like that? Uh, why wouldn't we dress like this? There's something you all need to see. Klaus, we accessed the video you recorded on your Digitab last night. Well, I never. Klaus is right. Those lights are following the exact patterns of our moves. And check this out. Beta? Wait! So that's how Orion knew our first secret move. But where are the lights coming from? Please don't say aliens. The truth is actually up there. You can try any secret move you want, but you won't stand a chance against Orion. Because I have reached new heights of football excellence! <laughs> In space, no one can hear you laugh. So where's Coach Black? <coughs> Observe. He was up in space the whole time. After surveilling your moves from his space station, he traced them out with the lights, teaching his players how to counter them. And the UFO hysteria was the perfect cover-up. I knew there was something weird about those interviews. <laughs> <sighs> Klaus, you have great intuition, both on and off the pitch. I should have trusted you more. Uh, sorry to ruin the moment, but how's knowing this going to help us in the second half? Yeah, we only have one move left, and you know the cat's out of the bag on that one. Well, Coach Black doesn't know that we are on to him. What are you thinking, Klaus? I have an idea for another new move. 
With the score still deadlocked, Coach is making his first substitution. Strange decision. Klaus hasn't been on the first team for ages. Ah, hello, Mr. Snooper Striker. You were terrified of the lights last night, but you're about to find out how scary they really are. <laughs> Move to brothers. Come on. <laughs> Just as expected. <laughs> I hope you're watching. Shakes to Twisting Tiger. Back to Shakes. Another failure. Orion saw the danger a mile away. Nowhere to go, Shakes. <laughs> huh? But Orion have left Klaus open in the middle. That's not move two. Follow Klaus. Follow Klaus. Follow Klaus! Believer Brenda. No comment. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> Wait, that means Super Strike is one, right? No idea. Yes! The one! Yeah! <laughs> I gotta call my mom! Yeah! 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 <laughs> <laughs> How did they do it? I hate them! I hate them! I... Self destruct oh! mechanism. Activated. No! Yes, you have 20 seconds to enter the escape pod. Stupid ship! You have 10 seconds to enter the escape pod. <laughs> Look! A shooting star! <laughs> Make a wish, bro. Ha, ah, it already came true. We won.